Hi folks, today we're going to try the electrolysis experiment. My daughter Sarah here is going to help us out and we're going to see if we can make a little something, make a little bang. To do this, you first need to have a plastic cup, you need to have some water, you need to have a little test tube, rubber band, 9 volt battery, wire, two wires, and some tape. What you need to do next is take your test tube. Take your test tube and take your wire. These are two wires all stuck together, just speaker wire. It makes it pretty easy to do, but whatever you've got at home, you do it that way. You need a copper part of your wire. This has got some copper on it right here. Take the copper part and stick it into the test tube, like so. You got it? Okay, good. Now, once you got that in there, I want you to take a rubber band and put it around the test tube like that. to hold the copper wire in there. So now we've got it all nice and secure inside there, right? Okay. Now once we've got that going on, the next thing I want you to do, take some water here and fill up your pitcher. Fill up your cup of water. After that, I want you to take some salt Pour it in there. About two or three tablespoons full will be just fine. Now, take your test tube or your finger or maybe even a spoon and stir around to get the salt to stir around in there. Take it stir up. Okay, excellent. Now, the next thing you're going to do is take the other end of your wire and connect it to your battery. Close up to you. Make sure the wire that's in your test tube is the one that you connect to the negative part of your battery. The negative is this part right here. Wrap it around there. Like so. Now take the positive part, the other side, wrap it around as best you can, like so. Take a piece of tape. Put it over there. There you go. Now it's very important that you don't have these two wires touch. Don't have them touch. That's a short circuit. Your battery can get very hot. If you feel your battery getting hot, rip the contacts off immediately. Don't let it get hot. But there you go. You're ready to go. Once you got that all set, this is the messy part. You ready for the messy part? <laughs> you want to take your salt water that you got and fill your test tube all the way to the top. See the messy part? With the, test, with the salt water. Now put your finger on the test tube, turn the test tube upside down and try to spill as little water as possible. Turn it over and dump it, sploosh, into the glass. Now you should start seeing some bubbles forming once you put it into the glass. Do you see bubbles? Yeah, little bubbles, right? Yeah. So once you see a little bubbles forming, you'll see that it is working. If you don't see little bubbles forming, then what you need to do is recheck the connections on your battery. Make sure that the copper wire is on the negative terminal of the battery. Make sure both terminals are nice and tight. And make sure no matter what you do, that the wires are not touching any other part of the battery. Make sure they're not touching each other at all. If you feel the battery getting hot or the wires getting hot, stop the experiment immediately and try it again. But give it some time, collect some bubbles, and then we're going to see what happens after that. All right, folks, we've waited about 10, 20 minutes. We collected a lot of gas. Now let's see what happens. We've got hydrogen gas in this test tube right here. We're going to let the rest of the water pour out of there like that. Put it back in for a second. Get this stick to light right here. Let it light for a couple of seconds. There it goes. Now I'm going to take this stick, put it in here, and see if we can get something. You ready? Here we go. You see that? 
There it goes, ladies and gentlemen. We've just turned hydrogen from hydrogen back into water with an explosion and a little bit of light and a little bit of sound energy. We've converted atoms to molecules, molecules to atoms. Very cool, everybody. Try this at home. It's a little complicated. It's a little frustrating, but take your time. You'll get it, and it's very, very cool. Bye-bye.